we are going to add two three-digit numbers using base 10 blocks. The boards are broken up based off of hundreds, tens, and ones. The first number we're going to build is 234. 234 has two hundreds. So we're going to use these hundred flats to represent the hundreds. 234 has three tens, so I'm going to use three ten rods. And 234 has four ones, so we're going to show four ones. Now we're going to build the second number, 378. 378 has three hundreds, so we're going to use three hundred flats. 378 has seven tens. So we're gonna grab seven of these 10 rods. It's four, five, six, seven. And 378 has eight ones. So I'm gonna show eight ones. So far we have four, five, six, seven, eight. So, so far we have built our first three digit number 234 and our second three digit number 378. So now we're going to combine our ones and ones together, our tens and tens, and then our hundreds and hundreds. So we have four ones up here and eight ones down here. If I use some of these ones up here and add them to our eight ones, I can make a 10. So I took two ones from the four I have, put it with the eight, and now I have a 10. When I have 10 ones, I can trade them in for a 10 rod. So I took the 10 ones, and I'm gonna make a trade for a 10 rod, so it's easier for me to add. So there's my 10 rod, I'm gonna put it down here. Now I'm gonna combine my 10s together. So we have three 10s up here, we had seven tens and then we had this extra 10 after we regrouped 10 ones. So if I have seven, eight, nine, 10, I can take 10 tens and regroup them for a hundred because 10, 10 rods is the same as a 100 flat. So we're gonna take these 10 tens out. We traded them for a hundred flat and join it down here with my hundreds. This is my remaining ones, my remaining 10. Now I'm gonna add up my hundreds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nothing to regroup. So all together, I have two ones. Oops, you can't see that. I have two ones, one 10, and six hundreds. So the sum is 612. We added two three-digit numbers using base 10 blocks.